sent for me, sir. Sit down, man. I'm afraid I have some pretty serious news for you. You know a student named Cindy Trestrell? Of course. Her father has made a report to the ministry that you took advantage of her when you took the athletic team to Trinidad. Take advantage? I don't quite follow you, sir. He says you took her to your room and you made love to her. Did Cindy see that? I don't know what Cindy said. But there will be a preliminary hearing into the matter. And Mr. Cowan will be conducting it. I have been asked to sit in. It's a serious charge, Ben. And I suggest you get a good lawyer. You heard about Ben? What about him? Uh, Mr. Trestrail came to the station today to report that Ben had sexual relations with his daughter when she was in his care. He reported it as rape. Ben? He did say Ben White. I told him as long as the girl was over 14, statutory rape was out. As for criminal assault, I told him he needed some pretty conclusive evidence before we could act. He called me a dumb idiot and threatened to report me to the commissioner. Ben didn't do it. What makes you think so? I know Ben. He wouldn't do anything like that. She's a big girl for her age. Damned attractive to him. Not many men would refuse her. Including you, I suppose. We are talking about Ben. He's a normal, healthy young man with blood in his veins. He did what any man would do. Not Ben. He wouldn't do that. I'll put my neck on the block on that. You always make Ben into some kind of saint. Not a saint. Just a man with principles. Whether or not he did it, they're going to make him suffer for it. That's what you want, isn't it? There's some more in the fridge if you want. Ben, I heard something about you and this girl, Cindy. News travels fast, doesn't it? How could you? I'm innocent. How could you be eating watermelon at this time? It's quite sweet. You should try a piece. Ben, this is a serious matter. It's not true. She says it's true. If she says that, she's lying. Isn't she the same girl you used to walk with? I walked with her once. And all we talked about was running. You expect me to believe that, Ben? Yes, I do. Well, I don't. What do you believe? I believe there was something between you two. You believe that? Yes. Are you saying I'm lying? She's not stupid, Ben. There must have been something between you two. She came to my room and asked me to make love to her. I laughed it off as a joke. And she went back to her room. You don't seriously expect me to believe that, do you? I don't expect anything from you. Why didn't you tell me about that before? There was nothing to tell. Or maybe there was something to hide.
Can't do that, boy. Doing it. Let me stop him. You're crazy or what? There is a doctor.